That is the grill master, Justin. After talking about it on the show on, uh, well, yesterday, Friday, Amy said that she was going to make a bacon explosion for July 4th festivities. And, well, not wanting to be outdone and finding out that Justin's a little bit braver to me than me because, well, the bacon explosion is nothing to be tampered with. Or trifled with. Or trifled with. We have decided to create our own bacon explosion. As you can see, Justin is laying out bacon for the weaving process. So we're going to go through and get the uh, weave done. Let's see what happens with this piece. Alright, there's our cross patch of bacon. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. Justin, you really did a good job there. Thank you, sir. Thank you, you. You, you did amazing. Thank you. Thank and you ramped it up. It was originally supposed to be, what, five? Five by five, and I think I've got a six by seven here. Okay. I just I just felt you couldn't go wrong with too much bacon. No, absolutely not. We still got a whole other pack. Exactly. So, then we got our Jimmy Dean sausage mashed out. Ready to go. Okay, uh, it's about time to fire up the grill and uh, start cooking the bacon for the center. Sweet. You're gonna smoke it, right? Uh, I'm, I'm probably gonna, yeah, uh, probably not a true like cold smoke because that would take forever. Uh, mm -hmm. It's gonna need some heat, uh, but I am gonna throw some. We've got the maple flavors. I'm gonna throw the lap along the fire. Uh, get us, get us some nice, uh, nice seasons, some nice flavors. You actually kind of sound like you know what you're talking about. <laughs> I, I've, I've fired up a grill once or twice in my life. A little standard uh, seasoning salt here. Uh, in this case, I use cookies and mixed it with. Chipotle, just a little smoke, a little flavor, uh, kicking it up. Okay. You actually pulled that joke on a video. I did. I, I couldn't help it. Okay. This would be the proverbial lightning bolt in our Frankenstein of bacon. This is what's going to bring it to life, Justin's grill. Oh! A lot of ash blowing up out of there. Yeah, I get it. So, essentially, what we understand from reading the website is that this will take about two and a half hours as soon as we get it on the grill. And, uh, yeah, just using your standard Kingsford uh, mesquite to uh, put in as his fuel source for his uh, grilling monstrosity here. And uh, now I sound like I'm on a bass show. <laughs> oh, and he's pulling out the the lumber. A bit of split apple here. Yes, we killed a tree just so we could make the bacon explosion. Ah. <laughs> he's getting a good base of Kingsford. Yes, Kingsford mesquite. Who knows? Maybe we can get. Uh, some kind of endorsement deal out of this. Kingsford Mesquite. I only grow with Kingsford. Charcoal and lighter blue. <laughs> I like competition with cats, but anybody from Kingsford watching, uh, we can use some charcoal. There you go. Somebody's gonna pull up at a big ass thing. Of... We're gonna land the wood in. Get a nice base going. Dump about eight gallons of that Kingsford on there. Ignition starter fluid. <laughs> Never have too much. Let that soak in for a couple minutes. I like how this has turned into a uh, complete instructional video on how to do this. Yes. Well, I don't screw here we go. This is where Justin burns his eyebrows off. See fire. See, the good thing about uh, Kingsford is that, uh, you know, you don't get that explosion of like gasoline usually does, like most other brands of. Gasoline does tend to explode. You know, like those other shoddy, less than uh, Kingsford brands of charcoal igniter yeah. fluid. Well, when you're using a, a char grill or grill. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Now, 
Why this heats up, we're on to fry bacon for the center. Fry bacon for the center. Uh, start laying out the sausage on top of the on top of the, on top of the bacon wheel. There you go. All right, we are now to the point of we're going to fry the inner bacon. Justin's going to do that. And what do you recommend for frying bacon? Cast iron. Always cast iron. All right. We'll Thanks for amazing flavor. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start laying our Jimmy Dean sausage on top of the bacon blanket to make the next layer. We're now laying down the Jimmy Dean sausage blanket. Like I've always imagined. <laughs> Okay, for all you health nuts out there, go yourself. Bacon! Justin is creating the crumblies for the center of the bacon. So good. It is. It's hard not to eat as we go here. Because I could polish off a good chunk of that. And now we add more bacon to the bacon explosion. And what Justin is doing here is using the force of gravity to allow the bacon to slide off of the cutting board. Common misconception. I was actually only using the force. Oh, okay. <laughs> Have you ever seen something so beautiful? I'm about to break into tears here. So beautiful. Should have sent a poet. <laughs> Alright, now comes the next step, which is the barbecue sauce, and we're going to dump a little bit of maple syrup in the middle of it just because of, well, it's all maple flavored stuff, and maple is good. And now, the rolling. Now, the reason at the beginning we laid down this non-stick aluminum foil is because it's non-stick. It's because it's non-stick, and, and right now that's, that's coming back. It's together. There you go. Uh, the ends aren't, aren't quite as, as, as nicely wrapped as, as what I'd like. This was a first attempt, but we can get this moved to the grill. Oh my god, it's creative. <laughs> Well, that Kingsford charcoal really set up nice, didn't it? It did. It really did. Uh, because there weren't too many instructions on the, the site about grilling, um, I'm going to choose to, we're going to put this on the top rack. Uh-huh. We're going to put a pan underneath it. Um, the block flameage. To, to catch the flame and to prevent uh, massive grease flare-ups. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we have done it. The crumblings are very tasty. There is the bacon explosion. And now we cut it open and we eat. Well done, sir. Thank you, sir. <laughs> The inner workings of the bacon explosion.